Dearly beloved, we are gathered together here in the sight of God and in the presence of these witnesses to join together Colt Carnes and Madison Ward in holy matrimony. We met at Coastal. We were both in our first semester there and we had a uh, science class together. I heard him before I saw him and there was something about his voice that made my attention just go straight for him. And I told him my first impression was he was uh, very put together and very pretty. Always was you know, dressed to perfection and it's kind of caught my eye. And she still does that to this day. Little did I know that was me meeting my future husband. It still gives me chills to think back to that moment. show you how I feel. My love, it's my heart that you understand. She heard this guy's voice and she was like thinking like, oh my gosh, I need to go on a date with this guy. <laughs> he had the cutest accent and he was talking about his dog and how he fed him Jimmy Dean biscuits and I just thought that was so adorable because I'm a dog girl too. That's one thing we share is we both love animals, so we took our dogs for a walk and one date led to two dates and it kept going and going and it really set in that, you know, I want someone to be, you know, in my corner for the rest of my life and that's how it hit me, like I knew, knew that's who I love. The night that we went to Ale House, we went into the bathroom and she was like, what do you think of him? And I was like, I honestly feel like you're going to marry him. And she was like, that's literally how I feel. When I heard they were getting married, I was pretty excited. Colt's a good guy. Um, I love him a lot. We were pretty tight. She was the best sister I possibly could ask for. You shine brighter than the stars in the sky. Melissa told me Colt wanted to take me and her out to uh, lunch, and we kind of thought we knew what he wanted to ask us. Sweat was rolling off his face. And he just never could find the right time to tell me and Melissa. And, and we, although we knew what he wanted to say, it was very uh, respectful and a great way to do it. Colt's a great guy and Madison's a great girl. They love each other and, and we're very excited for the future for them. I can't think back and think of a time when we weren't best friends and I'm just really happy that this is happening for her. Madison deserves like all this, you know? Like she really does. Everything, de des it, she deserves to be happy like this. After everything like that we've been through and yeah. everything, I'm just so happy. You shine brighter than the stars in the sky. I am yours and I know you are mine. I Colt take me Madison to be my wedded wife. I Madison take me Colt to be my wedded husband. To have and to hold to this day forward. To have and to hold from this day forward. For better and for worse. For richer and for poor. In sickness and in health. To love and to cherish till death us do part. To love and to cherish till death do us part. Who giveth Madison to be married? Her mother and I. If I'm being honest, Madison, you found a man that's not only going to love you and care for you, but he's also going to put you on a pedestal and he's going to make your success a priority and things you want to do in life. To find some kind of glow, I'm giving it some heart and soul now from the darkest grace. You are absolutely beautiful on the inside and out, and I am just so blessed to be here and get to see you and Colt happily ever after. I have no idea how much I look forward to today. Today, of all days, you finally admitted in front of everybody I am the best man, so. <laughs> Y'all 
lefts and rights, but it's a new chapter and I cherish every moment because every moment is going to be worthwhile. You've seen my worst, and yet you see some hope in me. She's sweet, good girl. Oh, I just wish him the best in the world. You know, it, uh, they're both young, uh, energetic, so wish him the best. It's like God made a complete, perfect person for me. I mean, we fit together so well. Cheers, <laughs> Emma!